Hey guys, welcome to this video. And yo, as I was browsing, right, I saw this video and I was like, three hundred thousand dollars a year in Lagos, Nigeria. Damn, bro, like, man, this nigga, this nigga should be crushing it, bro, like, three hundred k a year in Nigeria, man, you, bro, you are above the average, man, like. Bro, man, you are living the life. You are living the American dream. In the, in fact, you are living the Nigerian dream, oh boy. This is crazy, man. Like, you see, I, like I let's just even let's just get started. I just want us to get started. And also, please don't forget to like, subscribe, which will encourage me to make more videos like this. Okay, let's get straight into the video. I know everybody wants to be a billionaire. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody wants to be a billionaire. I want to be the basic things of life. You know, right. I don't. I'm not putting pressure on myself. As long as I want to travel here and I can afford it, that is all I need. Okay. Hey, bro. See how simple it is, man. Bro, 300 king in Africa. Okay. Bro, like that's crazy, man. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Let me see what my name is Pamela Adibuki. I'm 28 years old. I'm a digital marketer, strokes, social media influencer. Mmm, 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 bro. Nigerians, Nigerians, uh, let me tell you, bro. Like Cameroonian based in Canada, but I just want to tell you guys, I'm really inspired by Nigerians because these niggas are crushing it everywhere, man. Like, let's learn from these guys. These guys. When in Nigeria sits to do something, he gives his, his life his life to that task. There are three groups. I read the Jewish phenomena. Three groups of people you should be afraid of. Nigerians, Chinese, and Indians. Those three, bro. I make between two hundred to three hundred thousand dollars yearly and I stay in Lagos. Living in Lagos can be fun and at, at the same time can be traumatizing. I enjoy living in Lagos because everything is here. Everybody's you know. coming in Nigeria. People are working hard. So, we're about to start this walk. Let's go to work. Mm. Hello, Amaka. Amaka. Yes, ma'am. Afternoon, ma'am. Okay. Very well. What's up? So, I went to Lagos traffic. You're just having to The car is great. So, um, the car is great. I mean, it's 34 minutes from. With that amount of so money, you should, you should be careful, man. Like, you, you need security with that amount of money, man. I'm a digital marketer, brand influencer. Mm. Um, so basically, I'm a creative okay. line. You know, I do both consultation and all those strategies for brands and clients. Damn. 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 Okay, so I stay in a little bit room alone. Okay. I have my own room. I'm turning the room to a closet. Then I just trip. My rent costs about four million yearly. That's about three hundred and forty thousand per month. This is where I, you know, relax. Eight hundred and ten dollars per month. The PS Five for my friends. I don't play games. Only maybe once in three months. Bro, I think you should get more into real estate. So my gyms of vision. I spent fifteen thousand nine a month, and I don't have a personal trainer. I chill with my friends. Dang. I love enjoying life. I love automobiles, yeah? So I love cars. My car doesn't give me issues, so I basically spend more on fuel. A full tank is about 16.9, so let's say 16,000 air tanks for. Then my internet costs about. Cost. Okay. This per month is rent $900, savings and investments, 4.5. You know, food 600, 200. Oh, have realized. See, 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 see where the biggest portion of his money comes in savings and investments. So, bro, this guy, man, see, for whereas others, you know, savings and investment is one. No, 4,500, bro. How, how will he, how won't he be rich, man? 16,005. Um, I buy monthly data on my phone for 21,000. Okay. Bro, you, you uh, I 
we're trying to do primary percent goes into food and miscellaneous. Let's say 10, 15 percent because at some point in time I can be feeling the whole community in my house. Sometimes you go to expensive restaurants and you're spending so much and I'm probably spending a hundred and fifty thousand euro on, on one sitting. You know, at some months we are buying mama puts. <laughs> And I'm alive, you know. But some gross is say 250k monthly. The rent percent probably goes into miscellaneous. You have to give people something. You have to look at you have to pay school fees for some people. And you have to send money. You even though they are not asking you to send it, but that's a good boy. A lot of responsibilities on my head. I have five siblings. It's a lot. You should know this in Nigeria. <laughs> I think with time he will employ his siblings. That's the power of starting your own business. And remember, please, anybody who has a business idea, you know, or you want to start a business, I'm offering a free training, you know, whereby you can generate two hundred dollars per day. Check the link in my bio. It's very educative and great for you. Thank you. Um, I make, I make sure, sure at least 60 to 70 percent goes into savings yes, every month. Because 60 to 70. I know I love gadgets, I love automobiles and the rest of it, but I can only buy gadgets once a year. But the good model, I'm not spending so much and I know I don't, do, uh, I don't have much activities going on. I'm probably saving 1.6 million a month. Then I have stocks, so I buy stocks, invest in real estate. I put my money in fixed deposit. So those are the areas I, 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 I keep my money and put my phone. Wow. Real estate. Stocks. Bro, this guy. I don't know what to say again. What do you guys want to hear again? I don't know what to say again. I think the most expensive thing I own right now, like maybe it's aside from properties, it's my car. I drive a GLU for one way. Think about it. So I co own two restaurants um, as of now um, Lassibo and Flames. They are both on the mainland in Lagos, Surulere. Managing that and having this is, it can be so stressful, but then I have a very understanding partner. So he's more into the business than I am. Um, so most times, this is what I do. I don't go to my own office, I, I take my meetings to Flames. They said they should come and make my life easier. Let's come and do photo shoots. FreshBooks helps with invoicing, expensing, reporting, time tracking, and accounting. So you and your account. He manages to restaurants. The way I was okay. brought up has, has shaped me to what I am today because I studied something different and I'm doing something totally different. I started doing engineering, but I'm doing something digital. So growing up, my dad has a printing press where he still does in motion. So it made me the MD of his office, of his company at a very young age while I was still in secondary school. So after school... Bro, you guys should listen. Listen. Nigerians start training their kids at a young age. Bro, back in Cameroon, eh? Most of these shopkeepers, shop owners, at the certain moment, their children start managing their businesses. Africans, employ your kids in your businesses. Let your kids stop hiding money from your kids. Show, employ your kids. Employ your kids. His dad, he had in small printing press. He was already managing at a young age. Ah. Every day, I just drop my bag at home, go to one lesson and go to his office. So he gave me that leadership role at that young age. So that was what built me to what I am today. I learned graphic designing. When I got into into uni, I started doing printing. I would do I would do graphics, send it back home, do it. So I started making my money money at a very young age already. So what I just do is do um, ID cards for this department, do yearbook for that department, and I just send everything to my dad's press. Yeah, I think item works very well for that for the Instagram live thing or for the whatever you want to do. So don't blame me. I'm always on this phone. I can't really have a brief. I'm supposed to shoot for La Liga. They sent me football. I don't know where the ball is. I think it's somewhere around. And it's for the new season that is even yet to start. So this is exclusive for 2022, 2023. Can you see? So exclusive, guys. I got this from La Liga. Thank you, La Liga, for this. Wow. <laughs> 
So I said I was going to show you guys. So Binance sent me this gift yesterday, and I just think it's just right for me to show you what's in there. Binance, La Liga. Damn, bro. Bro. Like, see the brands he's working with, man. Like, yo. This Long term goals, financially. This guy is killing it, man. This I know everybody wants to be a billionaire. Yeah. I, mean, I just want to be comfortable. I want to be able to afford, afford the basic things of life. Bro, you know? Nigeria is grinding to pressure me, myself. Man. As long as I want to travel here and I can afford it, my kids want this and I can afford it. Oh, dad, it's it's all in Nigeria. Can we go to London? Yes, jump on the next available flight if I can afford that. That is all I need. I, I, yeah, I'm really, I'm really motivated. That's good. Right? Hi, Dami. Please, you are welcome. Please, I welcome you. It doesn't warm enough. Dami, I'm hungry. Mm. This is the restaurant he manages. I yeah, never thought I was going to stay for Spy. Or try something else differently than digital and everything. I never thought I was going to do business. Until my partner just reached out to me one day and he said, he wants to open a restaurant and what do I think we should go in a restaurant? My answer to him was just, what was the cost? And when he told me, I said, why not? Let's do it. I've been promoting different businesses over the years and they've been successful. So it's just right for me to put that same energy into this business. So I know how best to, you know, draw people's attention. So I've been using that same problem to push this business. So I, I'm not pushing it because it's my business. I'm pushing it like I'm really paid to push. Mm. Yeah, so it's the energy I give other businesses. I can like double that energy. I'm pushing this business. And so when you tell people you need to plastic body, you tell you, oh, family is restaurant. The business money we make in the business, myself and my partner, we keep it like in the business. So we have our different lives outside this, outside this, so we stick to that. So the business money stays in the business. It will be sure that we tell you that myself and my partner will receive sometimes less than 100 keep per month. You know, our salary of the business owners. Our manager earns more than us. So for it's the real, it's, so it doesn't look like we don't take anything away from the business. So that's why we are just paying ourselves salary. So I think the salary we get, that's all. Are you saying it's always you know plowing back, nigga? You can't be you can't be saving money because you want to buy a BMW. You understand me? Why not save money to buy a good car? You know, and with the remaining money, you know you can invest it. You have to plow. See, he pays himself the lowest. That's it. I understand it. The most important thing is cash flow. And that's basically it. And I've checked in my description below. You'll see a link that can help you generate cash flow for yourself. We're really expanding. Yeah, we, are, we have other, other places we are actually building right now. And we are in the junior stage, so by the time we are ready to launch, everybody will see it. But we are already expanding, like we are expanding rapidly at this point in time. Okay, now we have come to the end of the video, and yeah, if you want me to do more reviews, um. I'm gonna do again and please don't forget to subscribe like and maybe I may even do for this girl eh? Day in the life of a 23 year old tech founder in Lagos, Nigeria, bro. Nigerians are crushing it, man Nigerians are crushing it. Okay. Thank you. Please don't forget to like subscribe and comment. Yeah See you